Hello, so uh, I'm back for episode number two, if you will, status post bilateral carpal tunnel release uh, surgery. Um, I had the surgery done on Tuesday. It's now Thursday morning. Uh, I've just removed the bandages off of both hands, and if you're ready for this, I'll give you a show of the incisions and the stitches. It's no blood or anything, but it is, you know, if you're a little squeamish, it might get you a little bit. But there you go. Um, still some blue line. A lot of that is just marking. That's not really, um, what am I trying to say? That's not really um, blood or anything like that that's left over. Just in case you want to see that. There you go. Um, once again, no pain, full range of motion, a little tugging at the sites is all. Uh, yesterday I had a little bit more pain. I woke up with a little bit more pain with but with the lower tab and the Advil, uh, that was easily taken care of. I haven't been taking the lower tab um, as prescribed because I believe, if I'm not mistaken, the prescription was for uh, you could take one every four hours, but I haven't been doing that by any stretch of the imagination. It's been more like uh, maybe one every six to eight hours. So if that gives you a little bit of indication. And today so far, I've only had just one uh, shortly after getting up this morning. Also, uh, probably had the best night of sleep that I've had in a very, very long time last night. Um, I have absolutely no uh, tingling, no numbness. Everything feels great. It is one of those situations where uh, people said that uh, once I had the surgery done, I'd wonder why I took so long to do it, and I would have to agree with that. There hasn't been anything that I haven't been able to do so far. Now, I will say that the things that are kind of harder to do would be like your fine motor movements, fine motor skills, uh, like say for instance taking the top off of a soda bottle or uh, a milk jug, you know, something like that. And of course the inevitable going to the restroom does actually seem to be the hardest task. And I think it's only because of the, um, the angle in which you have to manipulate your hands, sorry. Um, but uh, having said that, uh, it's now second day out. Like I say, bandages are off. I'm able to go take a shower. Uh, I'm just simply going to go take a shower and I'll come back and I'll let you know how that goes and uh, also um, by that time it will be covered with the uh, with the larger what is it probably about a two by two bandage so uh, so far so good um, I can't uh, uh, I can't complain whatsoever um, good deal um, just simply not having to worry about which way you move your hands constantly uh, them being positional, having the numbness and tingling, I mean everything feels great and like I say I put up with this for probably 10 years or more um, and uh, today you know I've reversed that or I feel like it's been reversed for me um, by 20 plus years. I feel great. Hands are great. So I'll be back. Thanks.